told you you went to save this shit. And welcome back, everybody, to our MSM production. Today, I'm here with you with an Ark Survival. Come back here, motherfucker. I am currently on the road from Alex. He has stripped me down to my nipples, and he's going to kill me if he catches me. And oh shit, he's still coming. <laughs> kid never stops. Who are you calling kid, bitch? I don't know. Oh shit, he's still here. No, oh, he's gonna kill me. And I hope y'all haven't hope y'all are enjoying the series. I know it's you no know, entertaining for me at least. I'm uh gonna eventually get caught and die. And uh you know people joining Ragnarok. Did you just shoot something at me? Yeah. Did you throw a spear at me? I threw my spear. Ow Oh and you got narc or shit, that's right. Hey, um, I, I think I need to... Oh, God. I am out of stamina. Uh, well, I'm going to die here. Well, I'm dying of dehydration now, by the way. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you. I do appreciate that. Um, now please don't throw me off the cliff. Did you just put the clothes on me? Yes, because no one deserves to see what the audience saw. Uh, that is probably true. So I'm here with... Ow, he shot me again, I think. No? It looked like you just shot me in the face. Execution style. So I'm here with uh, Alex, Ready King as always. And of course, we are doing of course, our best... I'm the only person with the patience to hold your hand through this. I mean, you could also just, you know, let me die, and then we're all good. Like always. But why would you let me die? That's no fun. At least you are dragging me back to possibly throw me on the fire and cook me alive. You know me so well. I know, that's what I'm hoping you're doing, too. Mm, so warm and toasty. Yeah, hey, hold on. I hey, gotta uh, get the charcoal out. Yeah, ma make sure you roast my ass the most. It's the fattest part of me. Hey, someone slid into aberration. Hi there. Hey, I got a bow too. Um, bye. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's yeah, let see. Me just close that. Thank you, I do appreciate it. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, admin access only, too. Oh, yeah. Lucky me, the outer walls are the ones I can pick up. Mm, how lucky. What is all that noise going on? Call the damn forge. No, not that. Everyone's, like, freaking out. Nothing's freaking out. What the hell are you talking about? Something here is making a noise. This? Why this is... This noise? I don't know. Why is my bird on the roof? Your bird is on the roof because it's useless shit. useless shit that needed to be moved out of the way because it's taking up way too much space. Okay. That's fine. I understand. That yeah, kind of doesn't make sense. Yeah, put it back on the roof so you can just whistle it down whenever you need it. Dude, I have such bad... space saving. I have such bad luck with whistling. It is like, even though I have it bound to a button on my mouse as two quick whistles... Why are you moving him? Just to prove a point. Oh. Now he might be too far for Bert. He's too far for Birdie now. No one gives a shit. Wrong <laughs> <laughs> button, damn it. Get your ass up here just a little. Cl 
So maybe do follow all. Gosh darn, he's <laughs> still not getting it. Come on. Now he's getting it good. Perfect. Okay. Move him a little closer so he gets some um, level up as well. Stop following! A big door frame. So, what are we planning on putting in that, by the way? Something toothy that's undoubtedly going to kill you. And it probably will, in all honesty. Because what yeah, wouldn't kill me? Time. Oh, no. No, no. Oh, I thought you were coming to kill me. Oh, no. Something toothy. So, where are we going to start off with the Carnotaur? No. No, killing you is merely an afterthought. Ow. Oh, well, there goes my boots. Ah, <sighs> there you go. Do I have to fix them in the smithy, by the way? No, you can fix them in your inventory. You're just not smart enough. Though, if you keep stupidly provoking me, you're eventually not going to have a ghillie suit anymore to wear. I mean, I didn't do nothing to provoke that one now. Okay, yes you did. Don't make me start shooting. What did I do? You were breathing. Touché, but I still don't think that's uh, right. Okay, now you're, now you're provoking me again. What am I doing now? And it's cold. Got it. Defending your breathing. I really, I really wish. Can you upgrade movement speed on these things? No. No, I swear it was blinking there for a second. Okay. Wait a minute. Oh, this server must have the setting where you can upgrade movement speed on animals. Or on flyers. Huh. Huh. That's unusual. Yes, it is. Well, anyway, I'm going to go find us a thigh like a Leo. Okay. I'm going to go grab some water. In the middle of the night. Oh, I'm still wearing a ghillie suit. That's why I'm cold. Mm-hmm. Game froze up again. Oh, I think I just got kicked. I was in the air, by the way. Hmm. How unfortunate for you. Timed out. Would you? Yeah, timed out. Well, just rejoin then, I guess. Yep. <sighs> Hope everybody's enjoying this. Nine minutes into the episode. I'm sure they are. Your suffering is quite nourishing to our audience quite nourishing to even people who don't watch us if only we could add more suffering into the video well if we could Perhaps do mind you could it. tell them the sad sad tale of your life up till now well i was born thrown out the window a few times i'm pretty I mean, sure uh, i mean just that first part is just disastrous uh continue oh i'm on the ground okay Back on my bird. Good. It just spawned me on the ground. I was hoping it spawned me on the animal. No, no. Usually whenever you despawn, you ragdoll, and that forces the animal to drop you. 
It's only in very rare instances you log back on and you're still on the creature you fell on. I am uh, being attacked by an ant huh. in the air. Ants can fly, Charlie. I know, but out of all the things and all the places, it's just out of nowhere, didn't even expect it. And it has a sharper, sharper turning radius than I do, so I'm having a hard time hitting it. You gotta remember, Argentavis has a very wide um, arc of attack, so it doesn't really matter. So long as you can like face him like sideways, you'll still kill him. Yeah. What are you? Let's see what you are first. He's better than you. That's what he is. Well, I don't want to go down there to get water and refill my jar if he's hostile. Describe what it looks like. Well, I can't. Is the problem. Where'd he go? Is it big? Uh, most things are big now, yes. I can't even see it anymore. Is it very big or very small? Looks like a boar, almost. Looks like a boar. It's a uh, diodon. Diodon. A diodon? Uh huh. Oh, well, that is unusual. Should you I... don't usually see those things out in the open. No. Is that worth picking yeah, up? Yeah, no. They're not, uh, they're not friendly. Do not get near it. Okay. It's then. actually. Um, it's actually quite uh, deadly. Much like the wolves. Alright, well then I will go over here, away from that spot. Hmm. I don't think I'm getting water from here tonight. I just don't think it's happening. Yeah, you should go to the uh, red, uh, to the crimson uh, Ooh. mangrove for water. It's far safer. Ah, well now it's raining, so. Uh, I found a Tex Stegosaurus. Well, congratulations. You've won the award of the tame we don't even need because we can't transport it that far and it's super slow. It's literally just over the hill. It's also a giant walking light show, something we don't necessarily need. I know. But it does look pretty cool. Looking pretty cool is not an excuse. I know. I learned a blueprint for Shad Shagrug. Blueprint. Ironically, shag rugs are somewhat useful. Really? Yeah. I would have thought if it was someone bullshit. someone was listening to our base, it would let us hide our footsteps. Yeah, well, I found the blueprint for it in a cave drop, so I picked it up. Part of why I flew out was to go to these drops that are close. Found a thigh like a Leo, but he's only level 15. Should probably just pick him up and kill him. I forget what a thigh like a Leo is. It's the giant tree cats. Oh. So I see a yeah. sailboat here next to this drop. There's and no one here. Well, there's no one here, but it's just a sailboat in this water not too far from us. Well, first, there's no sailboats. This is a raft. That's a raft. Yeah, there are no sailboats in our. This is just a primitive raft. Alright, nothing useful here. Yeah, you can't do nothing with a raft anyway. Are you here or something? No, I'm just smart enough to tell you. That green one I think is going to be too far. That blue one's awful close. Hmm. Chris, 
Crystal Isles is so pretty at night still. Yeah, it is. It's got a lot of fireflies just flitting around in the air and just a whole bunch of niceness like that. And then you also got all these crystals which glow, which are pretty cool. So you want to know how to make my end of the episode jokes and stop giving me good setups for them. <laughs> Here's a better idea. How about I just kill you and don't let you make any jokes? No. That'd be terrible. Then who's going to consult me about them? No one. Because I won't have to do it anymore. Well, that's no fun. So, do you think I'm high enough level to open up a blue drop? Uh, depends how high level are you? Uh, 50 something. Yeah, you've been high enough to open it up since level 30. Okay. Hell, I can open red drops. What level does that take? I think 60 plus. What is the logic between which direction it makes you jump off? Um, a r nothing. It usually just always makes you jump off to the left. A ramshackle stego saddle. Mine seems to always do right. Um, again, rams ramshackle stego saddle. Don't know if that's any use, but I did grab it. It's really not, but whatever. Okay, well, I grabbed it anyway because it was one of those things you grab it quick while you can. Yeah. Here, let me check the web browser, see where Thylac Leo spawn. I found a really cool waterfall with a red crystal at the top of it. With a base nearby. In the middle of nowhere. Ah. Now maybe you should stop seeking out bases and instead consider working on ours. I'm not seeking Same. them out, I just happened to find it. I was over here getting a drop. And I saw a glow. I love these excuses that I keep hearing. It, it's so edifying. This is actually a uh, like cage. Nonsense. This is actually some kind of trap by the looks of it. it. Smells like just some wonderful nonsense. Mm. It's some kind of trap by the looks of it, because it's a, it's a bunch of platforms that's just got walls every other platform. And this it makes like a giant square. I see it glowing off in the distance on the ground is without a beam. What? Oh, no, never mind. There is a beam. It just wasn't loading in. Hmm. Let me go check this other area up here to see if there's a thyla in it. It's up further north. Another... Uh, and the only other place after that is dangerous. Because it's in the trees. Yeah, that seems fairly dangerous. Yeah, I don't want to have to 
uh, import one all the way from the redwood areas mainly because they have a bleed mechanic now can they hit you while you're carrying one yep okay so then yeah you really don't want to import it well i mean the argent may get bitten by one but i don't know if a wyvern would Let's see. <laughs> it's good to know that Red Obelisk is still kind of close to us. You know? Yeah. It helps us kind of find a find home. Or it helps me. I don't know about you, but it does help me. No, for me it's just by memory. Yeah. Didn't you say something about Gamer Team earlier? Yeah. How oh, they have a little metal box up on top of a mountain. Okay. I have to refresh my memory. Oh my god. What? I have located a huge, ponderous den of wolves. Well, I don't think that's a very good thing to have located. Without something that can just kind of swallow them up like they're nothing. Well, it's not necessarily bad, though, considering the fact that I can fly. This is true. Okay, yeah, I couldn't find a good level Thyla, so I guess I'm heading back. But you did find one, though, it just wasn't a good level. Yeah, exactly. There's no use in taming a bad level. I mean, we do currently have a have a taming boost on. Um, okay. I it's don't like think only you five, quite though. understand what taming boost means. I guess not, but I know it's like a, I think it said 5% taming boost. No, it said five times taming boost. Yeah. What does that mean then? It means you can tame an animal five times as efficiently as you could normally. It doesn't make the animal itself any stronger. Okay. Yeah. So in other words, that animal would still be shit.
there, Mr. Allosaurus. Are you having a pleasant day on the plateaus? You know what I'm having a pleasant day of? Getting shot. Not being able to find my way home. I'm in the oh, right area. I just keep. I can't that, find the the water area that will tell me, or the direct area that will tell me exactly where it is. I know I'm near it though. Charlie Bard lost his way. Probably. Good. Ooh. 